Hey, what's up guys? And um, today, uh, the product you probably saw in another video is a Circle 10 AK 5-cell um, chest rig for AK, of course. You probably saw another video. And I'm way a little bit lower, um, as you can notice it. Uh, there's a reason why I'm gonna explain probably during the video. Um, there's plenty of room for adjusted, let me say that first of all. So, most of the people read to wear the chest rig right here. Here is fine, as long as you don't worry all the way down like I see some people on the belly. Because that's not a belly rig, it's a chest rig. So, um, I'm wearing this one for some for a reason, like I said, I'm gonna explain in a second. Um, I didn't test it yet on the field. I'm trying with different magazines. It's already, it's of course, sorry, in Coyote Brown. Um, it has, let me say, overall a nice, a really good job of as far uh, stitches and everything. Um, if you were in a previous video that I did before, you're gonna see like a table view of it. Um, this is gonna be like an overview view of it. Anyway, uh, like I said, it's in Coyote Brown. Very well made, the fastener, really good quality. Uh, you got plenty of room for adjusting on your shoulder on your side and on your rear. So even if you're a big boy, you can do it. And if you're wearing a body armor, you can do that too. I'm wearing just a parka right now with a long sleeve t-shirt. So if you're wearing like a big heavy duty parka, winter parka, you got plenty of room again for wearing it um, in that uh, configuration. It has five bungees right over here, which you can clearly see. Um, it allows you to put uh, 40 round mag uh, 30 round magazine, sorry, with uh, those are backlight and um, some Bulgarians. Um, I tried with steel magazine and everything. You might need to break a little bit at the beginning, stretch a little bit the magazine uh, compartment. Um, you can also put a 40 round magazine, as you can see over here. You have plenty of room on the bungee. Right there, perfect. Uh, you can use the bungee, or if you are like in a situation that you don't move in too much. I have to admit the magazine is pretty firm. So if you're red, don't use the bungee, you can do that too. So if you're in a, like a range situation, you might be quicker without it. Or, any case, you can just pull it, put it on the side, and you're good to go. You can use the bungee mostly for retention. Uh, plus of this configuration is the fact that it doesn't make any noise when you open a pocket, like some old chest rig, like, or make a bunch of sounds, which might give away your uh, position in a certain situation, if you want to. Um, it's very easy to detach if you need to with the fastener, just removing the fastener. Or, as I noticed, and even if I tighten a little bit more, one thing I like about it is that I can remove the, um, the lower belt and I can just pull it like this in front of me. Okay, very quick compared to an, an H harness. That's the good feature of having an H harness uh, chest rig, as you can see that's an H with the also, it has also rubber, uh, elastic band so it makes it more comfortable on your back and it's really easy to re-wear it, it's just pretty much opening with your shoulder like this, your back and pretty much good to go I need to adjust it to the jacket and you put the lumbar thing and uh, strap, sorry, and you're pretty much ready to rock that's, that's pretty cool, I like it, that's one good feature about it Compared to the regular H, uh, sorry, X, X harness. An H makes more comfortable on your shoulder too. Uh, like I said, you, in my case, I can probably stand to, um, as I was mentioned before, adjust a little bit more. Um, what else I can say about it? Oh yeah, there is a vehicle section on the front, so you can put whatever, model patch or uh, whatever you prefer. So 10 pouch. Um, um, that's it, like I said, I was very impressed by the stitching, they are really well made. It's really robust, also the material, the Cordura, really good material, really well made. And right now it's on sale for, I think, $79.99 on their website. So a really good, good, really good price for a good AK vest. Now, speaking of removing it, so I'm gonna show, the last thing I wanna show you about it, it's um, on the back. I hope you can see it with the light, right over here. Can you see this? Okay, that's, um, there is a Velcro section over here, okay. So some of the, the um, plate carriers might have a section where you can actually attach it. It makes more, um, you know, put it on the top of it, more comfortable. Um, I don't have one that I can do that, so I couldn't show it to you, but just let you know that it's another pretty cool feature for some operators. Uh, another thing I wanna show from the inside, I don't know if you can see those nice stitchings over here and here, really well made, and it's an overall, 
uh, I want to repeat myself um, good product and uh, there's plenty of um, way to adjust it and make it conform conform to your setup I like the fact when I'm actually the one thing I want to point even if not wearing is the fact that your shoulder with this kind of uh, vest uh, sorry chest are really are pretty free so if you want to transition to one shoulder to the other one you got plenty of room over here and there's nothing on your way which is a cool thing um, that's it guys I think that was my um, it was a quick overview of it I hope you guys like it and if you have any other question let me know or you can contact Luke at their website which I'm gonna put underneath oh you know just ask me no problem there was a Facebook page and uh, that's it there was the circle 10 AK five cells chest rig review overview whatever you want to call it again if you have any other info let me know or contact circle 10 AK see you guys